When it comes to dentist appointments, I'm a giant baby. Other stuff though, like, I'm really tough, pretty, pretty strong and stuff, so. But there are a couple things that I'm excited about to look forward to today as well. I'm picking up the Fuji GFX 100S to test it for a whole week and make a bunch of videos about it. And basically I'm just vlogging today because I need a distraction because Dennis freaked me out, so I'm bringing you guys with me. Everything is fine, everything's, uh, everything's good. I'm gonna feel some pain, but you know what? It's not gonna kill me. Probably won't hurt that bad, everything's good, everything's fine. I'm gonna overcome it, and baby, my smile's gonna look even brighter. So by the grace of the Fuji fathers, I have survived my dentist appointment. I'm a teeny bit numb down in this region, but they fixed my filling. Everything worked out, and now we just get to have a great day, so we get to go Get the Fuji GFX 100S. I'm here, I can't not move anymore, I'm sorry. <laughs> Somehow my face is getting number, but we're gonna go get Fuji XT GFX T 100 ST. Here it is, Connor. Ow! <laughs> I hit my knee! <laughs> I definitely bought this, this wasn't sponsored by Lens Rentals. It was. Oh man, I'm so excited. I'm so excited, dude. Still a relatively new camera. Oh, here it is. Flip it out. <laughs> Whoa, that's Wait. beefy. Whoa. It's actually smaller than I thought it would be. <sighs> that's, pretty, that's pretty large. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not ready for this. I'm taking this back. We are about to go through all the goodies. The GFX goodies? The GFX goodies. Oh my God. Oh, does it take the same batteries? Yeah, same as the X-T4. No way. Yeah, dude. Wow, wow, wow. Dude, wow. that is so big. Wow, that's, it's, it's the great size. I wish they gave us the full flippy screen though. No, that's yeah. too unprofessional. Oh, right, sorry, 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 sorry. For the autofocus, so it's it's on the back now. Oh, that, that actually is way better instead yeah. of the front. Yeah, instead of like way over here for no reason. Yeah. We rented two lenses just to kind of be able to do a bunch of video tests as well as some really specific photography tests as well, so. This is the 110 millimeter, yes. which if we equate that to full frame, what's that, like a 90? We'll put it right here on the screen. Whoa. Boop. Oh, it's a 32 to 64. Yes. Kind of odd numbers, but that's cool. Oh, this is X-T4. XT <laughs> And then this is it's a big can of soup. G GMX. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Holy crap. Dude, it's crazy. It just it's chunky, but it's like it's like an XT4 that just like is bulking up for it leveled up. Winter break, dude. <laughs> just like getting buff. Oh my gosh, dude. The depth of field is stupid. My first friend. Did you hear that shutter? I did. It was like Welcome home. Scum, 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 scum. Dude, this is crazy. Here, stay right there. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Why is this so exciting? Because it's new and expensive. <laughs> <laughs> Hot sex. <laughs> oh my god, I can feel can, it. Can you put it up to the mic? The life of camera YouTubing is a lot of shooting pictures and videos of the product itself. And Connor is actually very good at those things. He has more experience than I do. He's shooting on his X-T4 with that Artisan 50mm 1.2 that we made a video about recently. It's really, we actually use it. We actually use it, so. There's a dust on my lens. With the X-T4, and I assume with a lot of other cameras, you can magnify, because I'm using a manual focus lens at 1.2, so it's really razor thin, and I realized that I missed the focus, and I wasn't checking it. So with this, you can actually push in on the back dial once, and it'll zoom in, and then if you rotate it to the right, it'll zoom in again, so you can get really critical, razor thin focus, even when you're shooting at a really wide aperture. So what part of the camera are you focusing on for the thumbnail? Specifically the Fujifilm text. We just did our FPV 
DJI giveaway it was live so stream. much fun dude it was so fun um Connor and Dave joined me pointed to the wrong people as I said their names hi and now we're gonna go to Waffle House oh, to get food cracked my back oh. and we're bringing the egg we're bringing the GFX 100s to Waffle House this might this might be the first time a GFX 100 has ever stepped foot in a Waffle dude, House I actually this could be a world first <laughs> <laughs> I don't who else would bring this camera into Waffle House who else but us also you're at 64,000 ISO right now and getting cleaner by the second I personally have now that I'm behind the camera more, I have come to like that just flip out thing. Because oh, really? the screen's right in the middle. You're not, so you're like cocking your head to the side to look at the screen. I guess that's true. Oh wait, one more time, one more time. Lens Rentals has been working with me since I was just making videos on my other channel to only a few people. They've believed in me since the beginning and they've been extremely helpful. So here's the deal. When I'm reviewing these expensive cameras like the Fuji GFX 100S, I can't afford to buy them because it's literally more expensive than my car. From SD cards to huge cinema cameras, they have it all. They have a huge selection of products and they ship it to you really quickly. They send you a return box, return label, so you can ship it back to them quickly. It's a very efficient and helpful process. So go to the link in the description to head over to Lens Rentals and use code ZAC15 at checkout in that little promotional area because that'll give you a discount on your gear. Thank you so much to Lens Rentals and thank you so much to you guys, the viewers, for actually supporting these videos, watching these ads. The true OGs, the true homies, watch the ads.